there's engine parts everywhere the alternator and everything so welcome back to another episode of we rebuilds today we have another fun and exciting video for y'all so we're gonna work on a 2013 ford escape the engine is blown in it so we're gonna have to take the old engine out and put the new engine in so it, this build is probably gonna be a quick build so i'll probably do either three or five episodes of it and then we just pop back straight into the audi and some more fun stuff with the bmw the m240 but if you like our videos please uh, consider subscribing if you're already a subscriber please just hit that like button and share this with your friends and family and if you want to support the channel click the link down below and copy yourself some merch we have the merch ready but now let's hop into this video so this is how inside of the car looks as you can see there's engine parts everywhere the alternator and everything look at the driver's side there's just parts everywhere and the back so let's go check out the back and the trunk so this is inside the back have a whole bunch of stuff inside on the trunk so we have a whole bunch of stuff in the back but we're gonna get it cleaned up oh and i'm gonna show you guys the engine compartment so this is how the engine compartment looks he dismantled the whole engine so i have the new one that I got from the guy too. He said he couldn't bother with it no more. So I decided to take it. So this is a new project. So we could work on this while we get some Audi parts. Cleaning is getting a little bit better. We have a lot of stuff inside. So I'm gonna keep cleaning. There is stuff everywhere in the back. So I'm about to start cleaning all this up and then move to the next thing. At least so it could look a little bit better. looks a little bit better i'm just gonna leave this around here till i get the vacuum so i can vacuum out everything the right way now it's time to move to the other side so now it, now it's about to get towed again Well, it's on the truck, ready to go home. So I'll see you then. I don't know why that's I don't know why that's hanging from under the car, but we'll go find out. Point oh, he said so I guess this is everything on it I'm gonna see if I could give Ford a call to see if they could give me to let me know if it could work or not but this is the the, the new one that we're gonna put in so now what we just need to see how bad is it and then we'll know what to do so this was already pulled out so i'll just take it off let's 
so he said one of these are bad so but since he already had most of the engine disassembled then we're just gonna keep on disassembling and just put the new one in yeah so both engines are two different things because this one the filter is pointed like front way and then the other one that the filter is pointed down and this piece is pointed down and the other one is pointed out so i'll show you on the other engine so the other engine is actually the 1.6 and this is the 2.0 so this filter is pointed down while the other one is pointed out and then over this side you could see so i mean this engine won't work so we'll probably have to get another engine or just the right engine to put back in it so that's a wrap for today's episode on we rebuilds so we find out that the 2.0 engine can't work in this 1.6 so uh I'm gonna either have to try to sell that 2.0 engine and see if I could get a 1.6 for the Ford Escape. That should be the only problem that's wrong with it. And that's the only thing that we, we know of so far. Uh, huge shout out to Dowdy's Towing. They're always hooking it up. Um, they have great prices. They don't just tow, they also haul stuff away for you. So his contact information will be down in the description below. So go check him out to get some great prices. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, subscribe, drop your comments and thoughts down below. If you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. If you're already a subscriber, thank you for watching. Hit that like button and please keep sharing. But until next time, stay positive, stay motivated.